What? Oh, it's you. If you come to complain about the trolley, you'll find no sympathy from me. I've told you before it won't run and you wouldn't listen. Your name is engraved on it along with your son's. It was a gift from your wife, Magnus. From Agna. No, she couldn't have. Agna. Take it. Do with it what you will. I hope you'll be there when the Talos stirs to life. I'm sure she'd want you to see it. Oh, it hurts. Makes me sad. No, why did you, did, no, intense music, now's not the time. Preparations for the enchantment are complete. When the heart hath been suffused with a sufficient quantity of ether, the golem should be restored to life. It's working! Let's go! You left me for this? This wretched heap of stone and rubble? This worthless pile of earth? And yet... I can't... I can't... What troubleth thee, child? Such a dad. Uh... I shouldn't be here. No, don't I say that. I don't her. deserve to be. I don't deserve any of the things you've done for me. Don't say that. I'm just a burden. Don't Helpless say that. and hopeless. If tomorrow came and I was gone, it would be better for everyone. Thank Red most of all. He'll never admit it, but I can see it in his eyes. I wish he'd just say it. Just say that he hates me. That he wishes I was dead so that she could return. Oh, not the again. <laughs> Twas I who set the oracle on her path unto the first. I who condemned you all to suffer these torments. Tis my sin alone. And one that will haunt me unto my dying day. Yet I dare not dwell over long on my many regrets. For the world is a tapestry of fates, interwoven and inseparable. And we who strive to better it cannot choose but make difficult decisions. For naught of worth was ever achieved without sacrifice. Were she here, she would not suffer thee to languish in sorrow. She would tell thee to seek thine own path, thine own purpose. It is a truth which I myself was slow to learn. Yet a truth it remaineth. <laughs> Have you no words for her? Not today. <sighs> Meanwhile, in the Crystarium. <laughs> Sorry, some of her words hit very close to home. <laughs> to what do I owe the pleasure that is your extended stay? Oh, I'm rather fond of sleep, you know. <laughs> a wonderful way to pass the time. Mood. <laughs> Not that my compeers would agree, mind you. Always on the move, the lot of them. Like La Habrea, constantly jumping from vessel to vessel. Come to think of it, Exarch, I don't believe I've ever seen you retire to your chambers for so much as 40 winks. However do you keep your eyes from closing? The cold shoulder. You wound me, <laughs> sir. Interactions you curiously refrain from sharing with the Scions and their champion. And risk souring your budding relationship? I think not. Much as I dislike you, there are more useful targets for her energies is that right fond of her are you <laughs> oh 
I'm really sorry. I was not expecting ah, that. Uh, yeah, some of those words um, uh, that um, Minfilia said um, have been things that I have have said multiple times. So uh, it's really, uh, really hit ho uh, clo too close to home there. Won't lie. Um, yeah, just kind of to me by surprise a little bit. Uh. It's okay, BB. You're doing great, Mephelia. Oh god, I don't like the look of this picture. <laughs> oh no. I'm going to take good care of the Talos for both their sakes. On behalf of my family and all the miners of Twine, thank you. Before we go, while you were away with Marie Rose, I prepared an extra set of cartridges for you. And this one. It's the practice cartridge you gave me. I know I should have thrown it away ages ago, but I've been adding a little extra to every day. After so many charges, I'm honestly not sure what it will do, but I wanted you to have it. Good luck. I love her. I'm feeling right. Uh. I know what you're thinking, and I will talk to her when the time is right. You better do. I've thought long and hard about what to say to her. To the real Mavilia. I hope when the time came I would know, but with every step we take, I feel more uncertain. Ariange? Thou must needs carry on without me. What do you mean? The path to Nobatha Rang lieth open. Whilst thou travelest thither to the south, I would apprise Mistress Elise and the others of our okay. progress. That's fair enough. Magnus, will the gate close immediately after the trolley passes through? No, it will stay open until someone closes it manually. Okay. Built that way to prevent any untimely accidents. Makes sense. Then you and the others can meet us in Nabatha Reng after giving the Yomorans the slip. Ariange. <sighs> uh, I'm just stressed. <laughs> Thank you for everything. I love her so much. Mephelia and her dads. Remember, thou needst but have faith. Off we go. Trolley time. No one's holding on to anything. Guys, he said to hold on. Wait, is that <gasps> Ranjit? Fuck's sake. What the fuck? You fell in the hole. Fucking prick. Doesn't leave us alone. Had you only sworn fealty to Lord Vorthry, you'd have no cause to skulk about like fright animals. You will remain as you are Ugh, while I dispatch off. these villains. No, I won't. I won't let you. Did you tell him, Infilia? You forget to whom you Ugh, speak. I don't like that tone. Who armed you? Trained you? Fought and killed a thousand sin eaters Shut the fuck you. up. I don't know about the world. But I never asked to be saved. However much it hurts, and however hard it gets, it's my life, and I want you to tell live him. on my own terms. Yes, you tell him. And those mad fools you want me to abandon. The ones I've traveled with, fought with, and may one day die with. They feel the same. So no. I will not be deceived. I'm so proud no of her. What you say, I refuse to believe it's all for nothing. I'm so proud of her. They're everything to me. All I have and all I need. And I would gladly do anything for them. <laughs> Let us pass. Or kill me. I'm not leaving her. here without them. So much. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, protect your daughter. I heard what you said, and I'm sorry for all the things I've left unspoken. You have to go now. I'll not have you waste that newfound resolve on me. But I love him. Not another step. Your fight is with me. You think yourself a protector? Ta! As if a whelp like you could be a better father to her than me! Shut up! 
You're not her father. What the fuck? Do I have to play a thank grid? Because I'm stressed. <laughs> oh, is that attacks? Um. Ah, was it ready? No, I didn't mean to do that. Okay, well, I guess I'm attacking now. I lied. Kept secrets, but no more. She deserves better. Stop it. I love you. Oh my God, he's so strong. What the fuck? You're not allowed to look cool. That's not fair. His last cartridge have to make it count. There you are. Ah! No! Come on! Anchor, please! The hell with you. Let's go! Did we do it? Oh my god, that was so stressful. Oh my god, thank Crit. I hate this. You would have her suffer and die. I would spare her that fate. That is not for you or anyone else to decide ever again. Oh, for God's sake. Oh, God, thank Crid. <laughs> Not a single day goes by that I don't think about all that you have given me. Countless memories and moments I took for granted. Gods, you grew up so fast. But you had to, didn't you? For those you had lost. For those you could yet save. A world teetering on the very brink of oblivion. For which you gave your everything. Without hesitation. Your kindness. Your compassion. Your love. <laughs> Then and now. <laughs> One last time, with a little help. I'm so proud to have been a part of your life. Man, this game is ripping my heart apart. Damn. This is the, like, the most that I've really, like, gotten attached to him i really liked him in all the other expansions but this one has made me really attached to him and like get it you know it's it's made a massive difference i feel like to his character this is the place marie rose this is where she stopped the flood the last time i was here when i felt a presence overwhelming me i tried to pretend it wasn't happening to just turn away but i can't turn away now no not this time for thancred and the others i have to face her so pretty oh no Oh. oh no, are we gonna see what happened? Oh god, I'm stressed. Run for your lives! It's the oh flood! god. The flood! Ah! The end is mine! Look, there's somebody up there on top of the palace.
Harper? No, stand back. We shall stay the flood. But this is what I want. It's my sacrifice to make. Your time has not yet come. When all hangs in the balance, fuck off, controller. You must give them hope. is a meeting long overdue. <laughs> My dear, sweet child, yours is a burden none should ever be forced to bear. Such pain and suffering you have endured, yet still you came. <laughs> I've lost count of the times I've almost given up. If people hadn't helped me every step of the way, I never would have made it. Tell me your heart's desire. <sighs> to defeat the Sin Eaters, and bring this world back from the brink. The remaining Wardens have hidden themselves from us. But with the power of the Oracle, I thought we might be able to find them. But know, my child, that the power you seek will come at a price. We stand now at the crossroads. A decision must be made. It is only natural to be afraid. To hesitate. It really is but very mother-daughter, isn't it? <laughs> you have grown stronger and wiser. And with the love and support of those you hold dear, you have grown to love yourself. Especially with Thancra being dad crit as well. <laughs> Man. The flood has washed away so much of this world. So many people and places Sun. and possibilities. <laughs> and all the heroes who fought to protect them. Yet here the Scions are, trying so, so hard to help those few of us who remain, and seeing how tirelessly they work, how completely committed they are to the cause. I can't help but believe that I want to do more than just watch and cheer. I want to make a difference. I want to help them like they helped me, and maybe even inspire others to do the same. I love her so much. <laughs> Coming together, providing for one another. That's the only way forward I can see. Since all of our heroes are gone, we'll just have to make heroes of ourselves. Tis a beautiful, wonderful dream. <sighs> One we share. Though my power was all but spent in staying the flood, I prayed this final act would give hope to those who survived. That self-same hope lives on in you. It gives me comfort to know that the future is in capable hands. If ever you should falter, remember this. No one, however powerful, is immune to the whisperings of doubt and despair. Look instead to the light within that you may continue to serve as a beacon to others. Thank you, Menphilia, for believing in us, for believing in me. <sighs> Dearest friend, no words can express my gratitude to you for keeping her safe in these tumultuous times. You are a hero to us both. Not even the most valiant heroes can stand alone. 
Only together may you change the fate of two worlds. Man. This fucking game. Oh boy. Uh, Ophelia! Ah! Uh, what ha- uh, Your hair! What happened? I remember speaking with Mavelia and then... She's ginger, she's so cute, but what happened? <laughs> Is something wrong? I mean both. <laughs> Your hair. A parting gift, I think. <sighs> and now I've walked the path she set before me. The path she set before all the Mavelias. But she's given me a new path. A new life. That I could call my own. And even though she's gone, I can still feel her. Warm and calm and gentle. I can feel the beating heart of the world, the light that swells within it. You don't think that crib will be angry with me, do you? <sighs> Welcome back. I see you fared better than Thancred. Where is he? Oh, he's there. He's fine. Aww. Ah, there you are. We were worried. <sighs> really? She wasn't the one that nearly got herself killed. Yeah, Alice, you tell him. It's Don't thing dress us out like that again. You, did. you were at death's door when we found you. She looks so worried. Minfilia? Oh. You saw her. I know I haven't exactly been pulling my weight up till now, but that's all going to change starting today. <gasps> I love her so much. I'll do whatever it takes, whatever it takes to make Minfilia's dream a reality. I can track the Light Wardens now, maybe even help you fight them. You're gonna have power. <laughs> do it. <laughs> I love them. <laughs> I'm glad you're back. You don't have to say that. You know, he cares about you. <laughs> but I want to. Your family. How else would I feel? <laughs> oh. She will need a name. <laughs> a name? A name of her own. I would not have her walk in the shadow of another any longer. Oh, Stola. And I think it a fitting tribute to our departed friend, too. At the mention of Minfilia, I would remember the woman who preserved our fellowship when all seemed lost. Do you remember what you were called before you were taken to Yulm? I'm sorry, I don't. I couldn't have been very old when it happened. Then we must think of a new name. Suggestions? <laughs> no one. I think Thank should, should contribute to that, no? If the lady herself has no preference, I think the honor yeah. should rightly fall to Thancred. After all they have been through together, he's practically a father to her. Well spotted. I'm so <laughs> glad you're here to explain these things. <laughs> And what exactly is that supposed to mean? <laughs> oh, nothing. <laughs> what about... Reen? Ah, blessing in Fae. <laughs> Wait. Doth this mean thou wert listening when I delivered my lecture on the pixies? <laughs> Not exactly. <laughs> that one word made an impression. Re. Yes, I rather like the sound of it. Thank you. That settles it then. Welcome aboard, Reen. I won't let you down. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> God, I love this game. God damn it. <laughs> 
Oh my god, this game's so good. Thancred is the best dad, honestly. Like I was saying earlier, like, I feel like Thancred especially, I've really, really attached to this expansion. Like, I always liked Thancred, but now, like, I feel like I've just really grown attached to him. Now that we've kind of explored his character a lot more and having his dynamic with Breen definitely really helps um, build his character more. And I feel like they've done a really good job of this expansion so far. Final Fantasy the epitome of you get what you gave in gaming, the more you care, the more it rewards you. Yes, exactly. Like even just like, I know it's really silly, but like even just Alfie saying that like he gets to name Reen because he's like her dad, like it's such a nice moment, you know? Like it's just, it's a small detail, but like it has such a big impact on this, like on their story together, you know? Show me because it's so good. They gave Thank Chris so much substance and he arranged so much sex appeal. They did. <laughs> they did. <laughs>